Welcome to my channel, Steve with the Window Cleaner. Today, I wanna to talk to you about the two pool rule. It's not really a rule, but it's something really good to train a new employee on to get them to be moving quickly. So if you're training new employees or you're getting into window cleaning, this could help you just be able to complete the job quicker right away. But still, you're gonna to wanna to work on fanning, but let's go over the two pool rule. What is it? So with a 14 inch channel, on this type of window, I can do two straight pulls to finish the glass. When you're starting out and you're working on getting the fanning motion down, it's not working quite good. A good way to combat that is to also be doing straight pulls so you can get going right away. If you're gonna be working for somewhere, they're gonna want you to be cleaning pretty efficiently, pretty quick, so it's a good way to get going. So this fortunate squeegee, if you look here, right? Basically two swipes covers the whole entire window, but if you were to have a smaller squeegee, such as an eight inch, it's gonna take you three pulls to clean that window. Now, let me get into why we don't do three pulls on a window like this, especially if we're looking at residential. Commercial is a little bit different, but for the sake of the video, let's just keep it to what I'm talking about. So when doing three straight pulls, one other good idea is to lightly detail your top edge so you don't have so much residual water or wiping your squeegee blade, okay? So we do that. Now, if we do one, short, one pull, we got that. Now what we're gonna do for our next pull is feather a little bit and angle and bring it down. And this almost covers it. Okay. So what happens here though, is you leave a possibility, I don't know if you see it here in the video, there's a, a cloud here, a line, there could be another line here, but you're bringing up the chances of having more streaks, right? With a two pull, it's just two, so the limits are a lot less, right? So that's why if you're gonna have to do three pulls on a window, then you're gonna wanna fan the window, you're not gonna wanna do straight pulls, okay? So that's part of the rule. If you have to do three pulls, you're gonna fan the window, not straight pull the window. And that's where you'll work on learning your fanning technique. So for two pulls, the technique that I would suggest doing, one of two things. If you have a 14 inch squeegee, either take the edge of your rubber here, be real careful not to shove the um, actual corner of the channel onto the glass. But what we're doing there is I've removed solution from the sides I remove solution from the top and from this side for the most part. That way, when I squeegee, there's not a whole lot of detail and there's not a whole lot of water at the top and I'm dragging down the glass and creating streaks. So first pull, I've wiped my squeegee, I pull it down. There's very minimum water here left, still a little bit for detailing, but it looks really good. I don't see any lines. All I like to do is just um, dry off the tip of the rubber there, right there. I like to keep the rest of the blade lubricated with solution. I feather a little bit and I pull down again. And that is it. And that is a very quick way to get efficient at cleaning windows. And a lot of veterans operate that way too. But, you know, if you're gonna be having to do three pulls, right? So let's imagine that this is a larger window and this is maybe like a 12, 14 inch squeegee, right? So if you're doing three pulls, we're not gonna we're not gonna straight pull, we're gonna fan. It's a big window, right? Okay. And we're gonna fan because it's gonna be a lot quicker than doing straight pulls. So that's it. It's just a two pull rule that I think is a very good thing to implement into either when you first started cleaning or from employees coming on. If you got any questions, comment below. Talk to you soon, bye.